May your heart be your guiding key. Picture this. Huh? A black goat stashes away a letter, then orders a white goat to search for it. What could his intentions possibly be? Great! A riddle! Just what I need! There are many possibilities. Perhaps he forgot where it's hidden. Or he's playing a prank. Or the letter has truly gone missing. I can think of several reasons offhand. Guessing is simply useless. Well... Then just follow your orders, plain and simple. Yes, that's what I've always done. I follow the orders from above, without question. However, I sometimes can't help but read into my opponent's strategy. <laughs> Too long on the job? If the contents of the box are so unknown, why is it of such critical importance to the organization? Furthermore, was it Xehanort or Xemnas who gave the order? Well, it's tricky. All Xehanort cares about is the clash between the Seven Lights and Thirteen Darknesses. It's unlikely he would hold such an interest in this mysterious box. Which means, the order was issued by Xemnas, or the one who informed me of my task, you. As if. It must have been Xemnas. My inquiries suggested otherwise. Oh man, you asked him. What are your intentions? Look, I don't know what's inside the box, but it's been protected by Keyblade wielders since way back when. Aren't you curious? I heard it contains information that's vital to all Keyblade wielders. Secrets. And where did you hear this? Hmm, I don't remember. I keep my eyes and ears wide open, but I've traveled so many different places, it's hard to keep everything straight, you know? If this box is truly as important as you say, why now? I believe you discovered that others also seek it, and you need to find it before anyone else does. In order to keep your connection to the box a secret from those around you, <laughs> Zigbar, who are you really? <sighs> no matter. It doesn't make a difference to me. It's all the same. I'm content to feign ignorance. The question is who are you? Luxord. <laughs> but so funny, old man. Mind sharing with us? I stand here today because of a fated encounter. Very many years ago, when I was still a young lad, I never learned who he was, and perhaps I never will. But I see now the truth he spoke of. <sighs> we don't have time for bedtime stories. Without the kid, we're still down a 13th vessel. And as for the other 12, only three of us are here right now. 
Are you absolutely sure the others made their way back to their respective times? Hmm. Hmm. Marluxia and Larxene are both here in this time, attempting to locate the new Seven Hearts. Luxerd is also somewhere about in this age, but after our last meeting, he went in search of something per your order. Isn't that so? Huh. Oh, that. Right. Well, let's just say that what he's doing will benefit us in the long run. But it's really of no importance right this second. Go on. Playing your cards close as usual. Hmm. All right. The hearts of Ansem, Semnus, Venetus, Riku Replica, and young Xehanort returned to where they came from and reassembled once more. Each of them is seeking a Guardian of Light. So, the ones who turn human, and then back again into nobodies are... Me, you, Luxord, Marluxia, and Larxene, that's five. The ones from the past transferred into replicas are Ansem, Xemnas, Vanitas, Riku Replica, and the old man's younger self. Then we add the old man in... The total comes up to... 11. I think we're still missing two. Now we must discuss... why we have assembled here today. My incarnations from past times, vessels into which I transferred my heart, my essence, were destroyed. Thus I was restored to what you see now. For one to completely disappear, their heart and body must be restored to their original form. That is one reason why I distributed my heart into several vessels. Ansem and Zemnis originated from Terra, or rather his young form, and it too was restored. However, my heart has returned to me, while his is yet lost. I decided to fill this hollow vessel with my heart. Indeed, the very same heart that previously resided within Young Terra. So that makes twelve. Then, who do we get to replace the kid? Twenty replicas were created by Vexen. The first twelve were nothing more than puppets, barely human. The prototype model was the Riku replica, and then number I was made. That leaves us with six. Ansem, Xemnas, Venetus, Riku replica, and young Xehanort's hearts. Five vessels, one left. Vexen and Demix are candidates, but backups at best. The plan for the last replica is to give it a heart that is connected to Sora's. Connected to Sora? Anyone in mind? The second prototype that was created, number I. Though erased from memory, it remained in Vexen's records. Its existence is greatly linked to Sora's memories, and thus should prove to be more than adequate for our needs. Number I. An imaginary number. How fitting. While young Xehanort is occupied with transferring hearts, I must go fulfill my duty. I will go and retrieve Vexen. Reliable as always. It sounds to me like you've got everything dependably under control. Well, I'm off to do my part. The plan, 
as we agreed upon. May your heart be your guiding key. Hey, let's speed it up. Keep the line moving. Keyblade, it'd be different. Like you're actually worthy to use one? Oh. I am worthy. Huh? What do you mean? <laughs> the old coot promised to bequeath me his. Why else do you think I would ever put up with all his nonsense? It'd be wasted on you. <laughs> As if. <clears throat> uh, what? 